So Waypoint is our fall seasonal. Uh, it is a collaborative beer that we do um, with tandem uh, coffee roasters, uh, who's right here in our neighborhood, right around the corner. We've been going there and drinking coffee since they opened, um, and uh, we're really excited to be able to work with them uh, every year to do the to do the fall seasonal, which is a uh, a coffee porter. Um, it's sort of a, a brown porter style, um, not quite as robust and as roasty as some porters, um, because we want to be able to really highlight the uh, the character of the coffee. Um, like many of our beers, uh, we strive for, for balance with this beer, a nice balance between um, sort of uh, chocolatey notes from the uh, from the malt bill um, and then the, the supporting fruit notes from the coffee. Um, and every year we produce a slightly different coffee blend based, based on what varietals are available. Um, but we're always looking for that sort of fruity um, coffee note to come through in, in the blend that we create. Um, this is our third year of doing the Waypoint blend, which is a coffee porter. We provide the coffee. They provide the beer. So yeah, coffee is uh, grown on coffee trees. Um, it's grown as a cherry with two seeds on the inside. Um, those being coffee beans, uh, what we call them here. Um, and it's grown um, throughout, you know, the equator. Uh, generally roast um, on the lighter side. Um, not too light, but definitely want to trying to highlight you know, the fruit notes as much as possible. Um, from the time and temp blend, um, you should get some nice uh, bright citrus notes because um, it's Colombian, Washington, Ethiopian, and Kenyan. Um, all nice, bright, sweet coffees. Um, and then from the Waypoint blend, you'll get like more like caramel and apple from the uh, Colombian coffee, and then um, some nice like, cocoa, cherry, strawberry from the natural. We're using locally grown and locally processed uh, uh, rolled oats uh, in this beer. So the oats are grown here in Maine, they're heritage style oat, uh, and uh, processed at Maine Grains up in Skowhegan. Uh, so we've been working with them for a lot of our local non-malt grain ingredients. Um, sort of highlight all of that local, uh, local goodness in this particular beer.